Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's me, Croy, and I am here in a lab. In this video here, I will be showing you guys how to separate serum from whole blood. Now, first thing is first. When you're going to draw a patient and a SST tube is required, the SST tube has a gel, as you can see, at the bottom of the tube. Now, this gel separates the serum from the whole blood. The serum does not contain any clotting factors. The whole blood is separated from the serum by this gel. When um, this tube gets to the laboratory, um, it's the serum that's going to be tested. It's not your whole blood when it comes to a SST tube. It's the serum that they will be testing. So without further ado, um, let's get into it. First thing is first. Um, you have your tube here. And as you can see, there is serum at the top of it, the liquid portion of the whole blood. Now, You will need a pipette. That's what this is, a pipette. And what you're going to do is you're going to remove the top. You're going to squeeze the top of the pipette. You're going to squeeze it. You're going to hold it. You're going to stick it inside the SST tube. You're only going to go down about two inches at the most. Because if you go all the way down, the pipette is going to get mixed in um, with the gel and you don't want that to happen okay because the gel is not being tested it's the serum so you gently let, let go of the uh, top portion of your pipette and as you can see there's your serum and you just pour it pour it away And there's your serum. This is what's going to be tested. The serum. Again, you squeeze the top of your pipette. You put it inside the tube. You only want to go down about two inches. You gently start to let go of the top. And there's your serum. And put it inside of whatever container is uh, required to run a test and that is it my friends that's how you separate serum from whole blood from an SST tube um, my ne in my next video I will be showing you guys how to separate plasma from whole blood so stay tuned